when we review it now. Kilkenny obviously view it as a very successful year. Tipperary maybe to a lesser extent, they ended up playing to all Ireland finals, I suppose, without, you know, without achieving their ultimate. Um, us Cork people were bitterly disappointed with the way our season finished up. It was probably our poorest performance in a number of years, but overall, you know, the gap is closed, which is the most important thing. You know, the, the steam train that was um, Kilkenny a number of years ago, this untouchable Clare team from the year before that no one thought could be matched a rival leader. But Kilkenny yet again came up with a strategy and they brought everyone a small bit closer again. Anyone in the five counties are going into that championship time this year. Realistically, we have a chance of winning Munster. You know, Waterford are at the back of a bit of success in Northern Ridge. Last year was a bit disappointing for, disappointing for them. You know, they'll have their own measurements of what success is for the coming year. Would it be winning a first round of Munster Championship? Well, I think Waterford have always expected a small bit more. As we know, Limerick, Clare, Tipperary, throw ourselves into the mix. It's it's a minefield. Any one of them five could be could could eventually win it. You still have Kilkenny, you still have Galway, you will still have a rejuvenated Dublin under Jer Cunningham. It's I think in my own in my own opinion, it's a, it's a wonderful appointment for them. You know he'll really well from what where Anthony has left them. Jer will go to to hell and back to to get him to over the line again to get him to the next stage. So it's a wonderful appointment there as well. I generally be under the belief that the game of hurling is fine. You know, we've, we've, well, we've, the way we've played it, I've never seen that wrong with it, but obviously the penalty being the key issue here, um, it's probably an issue that has been left drag on and drag on, but no, look, they've put a, a trial period in place. It will alleviate probably the, the issue of the throwing the ball the, inside the 21, a one-on-one. -on -one. It's the fairest way. You have to give the attacking team the advantage. If, like, I know as a defender, if I was faced with a situation where you know, the forward was going through and goal and I pulled him down. Like you have a better chance of stopping a penalty than you do of, you know, uh, of, of, of a one on one he taking on the goalkeeper. So yeah, look, that would be a positive. It would be it's it's a step in the right direction. You should always give the benefit to the attacking team. It's early season, it's early doors, but you know, it's a unique thing for us to look forward to a hurling championship. We're lucky uh, as an island, we have that to look forward to. No one else has it. It's unique. You know, as soon as May comes, we'll be all buzzing with excitement. Mm -hmm.